Hey guys, Ray and David here. It is July 11th, 2009, and I'm very excited to be unboxing my iPhone 3GS white 16GB. Yes, I went with the white model because I'm a fan of white products, and I love the Apple keyboard, which is part aluminum, part white. Mighty Mouse, right here, as well as many other Apple products. It's very Apple to me. And I went with the 16 gig model because I do not need 32 gigs for my phone. I mostly use this for applications, some music, some video, but I mostly use it for the apps and the phone functionality. So, and, well, I don't really have $300 just to throw out. So I had to spend 200 Anyway, long story short, guys, I'm, I'm very excited to, to be unboxing this. Here is my original iPhone. Um, I've had this thing for two years now, and it survived those two years very well. As you guys know, I love my iPhone very much. Um, it's the best phone I've ever used. And I'm not just saying that because I'm an Apple freak. This phone has literally changed the way we see phones um, from now on. Whoa, come on. Focus. There you go. Good boy. Anyway, guys, I'm here to unbox my iPhone 3GS before I babble on too much. So let's do this. I am extremely, extremely excited about this. Let's do a nice clean cut. This isn't going to be the best video because I know there's a lot of iPhone boxes out there, but I asked everyone on Twitter if they would still like me to do one. Twitter.com slash the creative one if you want to follow me for exclusive updates, as well as important information um, and stuff like that. Anyway, here we go. Here is the box. Very, very nice. Ah. Some plastic on the inside. <clears throat> And there is the iPhone 3GS. Finally, guys. It feels great to hold one. Um, I did play around with one in the Apple Store for a little bit um, at the Freehold Raceway Mall while I was in Seaside Heights for vacation. And I really liked it, but this is my first time really holding holding it, um, not counting the in-store model. And I, and I apologize for my voice real quick, guys. Um, if, if my voice cracks loud or if it's raspy, that's because, like I said, I was just on vacation, and I was yelling a lot, and I had fun, so that's pretty much why I sound like crap right now. But, you guys are my viewers, so I'll do anything for you guys, well, in terms of making videos. Anyway, here is a plastic piece that comes with it. It's pretty sturdy plastic. You can barely bend it. Either that or I'm very weak. Here is a small booklet that comes with it. It's probably, yep, fingertips, there it is. Um, you don't really have to read that, but whoa, that's a crap load of iPhones. That's like an iPhone orgy on paper. Check that out. And instruction manual. Who really who really reads instructions, guys? <clears throat> well, I don't anyway. No offense to those who do, it's just not for me. And of course, you get complimentary Apple stickers, which I will find a place for, I usually do. Here is a SIM removal tool. How does this come off? Because you just... Yep, there it goes. Rip that little piece of paper off. This goes in my original iPhone to get my SIM card out to transfer my contacts as well as any other information I have to transfer over. Going inside the box deeply. Well, more deeply. Well, whatever. I don't know what I'm saying, guys. Um, very standard... Well, very standard. A standard uh, power adapter. Very small, I meant to say before. Very small USB charging adapter. Gotta love it. USB adapter, uh, the 30 pin connector for the dock, iPhone dock. Uh, keep in mind, the iPhone no longer in includes a dock like it did with my iPhone, which kind of sucks, but it's not a big deal. Um, if my dock doesn't fit with it, then I'll buy a new one. But I have the universal dock, so it shouldn't be a problem. That fits every iPod and iPhone, as far as I know. And your standard e uh, earbuds uh, with included microphone. And that should be it. And there you go. It's kind of a unique box. I like the little um, cut out there. Anyway, let's take this plastic off for the first time. This is always like a geek's dream come true. Ah, uh, yes. Very nice, guys. Very, very nice. And here is the original iPhone. As I almost drop it. Here's the original versus the iPhone 3G. As you can see, they look very, very similar. Sorry, 
camera's at an awkward angle over here. I'm having a hard time doing this. Here's the back. I really, really like the white a lot more than the metal. Um, I was kind of disappointed when it was still plastic when Apple unveiled the design about a month ago or so. But I gotta say, the plastic, I mean, the white plastic looks really good in person. And it, and, it won't, and it won't really show smudges that much. As you can see, my original iPhone is pretty beat up. Um, it's, it's seen a couple drops, but it's still working perfectly fine. Anyway, guys, there you have it. The iPhone 3GS 16GB white unboxing. Be on the lookout for other iPhone 3GS related videos. And that's pretty much it. Thanks for watching.